Disclaimer, this video is for comedic purposes only, and in no way does this video or the ideas or statements in this video accurately reflect our views and or values. We do not hate the IRS or its agents. Please research and develop your own ideas on the IRS, and please pay your taxes or the government will reprimand you. We are monkey-brained individuals and are only making jokes, so please do not attempt to recreate or follow any of the instructions here in this video. Viewer discretion is advised. <sighs> my balls are... Hey, everybody. This is just a disclaimer real quick because, you know... Don't want to get in trouble, but you should be paying your taxes. And if you don't pay your taxes, the government will 100% come after you. And, you know, that's, that's kind of bad, kind of cringe, kind of sus, if you ask me. So, pay your taxes. This is just a comedy video. Don't, don't listen to what you see on the internet. Okay. Alright, everybody, these are the top ten reasons for why you should be committing tax Hey guys, so today we have the top 10 reasons for why you should not be paying your taxes. Okay, this comes up all the time. It's like, why should I be paying my taxes? You know, people ask me, Ryan, why should I be paying my taxes? I don't want to pay taxes, okay? That's my money, and the government is trying to take that money from me! And they're trying to spend it on other things. So today, like I said, these are the top 10 reasons. 10. 10 on my fingers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 reasons for why you should really not be paying your taxes. Let's start with reason number one. You hate the IRS. Okay? It's not, I don't, I'm not telling you to hate them. You just hate them. They're taking your money. Okay? It's like, you get a sandwich, okay, that you worked very hard to make, and then all of a sudden, big old daddy government comes in and takes 10% of that sandwich, or X amount of percent of that sandwich, whatever, wherever you live. And they take, they, he eats that, he eats it right in front of you and says, yummy, yummy, yummy. Or maybe he spits it out and does something stupid with your sandwich, and it's like, hey, what the heck, daddy government? I don't like the way you're spending my money. But, so, yeah, that's, that's the first reason, because you hate the IRS and what it does with your money. So, therefore, you shouldn't be paying your taxes. Okay, next we move on to reason number two. So, the next reason for why you really shouldn't be paying your taxes is because paying your taxes to the government supports the patriarchy. Yep, you heard it right, folks. You know, if you, if you don't like, you know, toxic masculinity and all these big old men taking your money, you know, coming in and taking your money, then you shouldn't support the patriarchy by giving them your money. So, okay, whenever you give your tax money to an IRS agent, they are taking that money and using it to oppress women. So if you are a feminist, you should not be paying your taxes. That's why you should commit tax evasion if you are a feminist or just even if you support women's rights because the government will take that money and they will use it in the patriarchy. Okay? I don't even know how that works. It might, I might be spitting straight lies. But you know what? Men are in the government, and therefore it supports the patriarchy. Boom. No taxes. Okay, reason number four. Okay? So, if you've watched our videos in the past, you know that there's a huge conspiracy going on with the moon. And that's what we're here to talk about for reason number four. So, there's a guy out there. All right, so then, uh, so the government takes your tax money and spends it on a mind control program, okay, on the moon, and it's hosted by Barack Obama and bin Laden. Yes, you, you know, guys, if you've seen our channel before, you know that the moon's fake, that bin Laden's hiding up there, and he's in conspiracy with Obama and Trump and Joe Biden, and they're hiding up there on the moon right now. Okay? The moon is not what you really think it is. The moon is fake. The moon is a spacecraft above our flat earth, which basically made in 1963 by John F. Kennedy to create his mind control program. Okay? Now that he's gone, he's, he wasn't able to finish the project. Now Obama, Trump, and Joe Biden are picking up on that right now. And they're using that. Bin Laden's up there right now. That's his bunker that he's hiding up there. And one day, they're going to use it to mind control you and bring back all of the lizard people. Okay? It's dangerous. It's, it's crazy. And it, it's just downright wrong. Okay? Uh, scary moon. Okay? Moon's not real. Moon is fake. Government's spending your tax dollars on that 
fake hunk of metal up in space right above our flat earth and trying to make it so that you will be mind controlled. Will you really allow that to happen? You shouldn't be paying your taxes. Because if you do, Obama, Trump, and Joe Biden, and Bin Laden, who is on the moon, his space bunker right now, they will use it to oppress you. Okay? So don't pay your taxes. It supports, it supports them. Okay, the next reason, number five. Five, okay, five. One, two, three, four, five. The reason, fifth reason for why you shouldn't be paying your taxes is because you can spend that money much better on a bunker, an underground bunker and rations to hide from the government. Yes, you heard me, the government. The government wants to pry on you. The government's prying, spray, spying eyes. The government's, the government's, pr the government's spying eyes are looking down at you, okay? They're trying to see what you're doing. They're looking through your little snapper chatters and your little ticker talkers where you do your dancer videos, okay? And they look through that and they see what you are doing, okay? So if you want to hide from the government, you don't want them doing these things and you shouldn't be giving them your tax dollars so that they can spend on that and spy on you. And like I said in the reason before, so that they can use the moon to mind control you. And when that happens, you will need a bunker so that you can hide from all the rays that come down from the moon and control your mind. Okay, they're using the 5G waves and they're going to do it. They're going to, I don't even know, man. They're going to do it. So then you need a bunker so that you can hide from all of that and stay safe. Keep your family safe. Okay. You need to do certain things in life to keep your family safe. And if you don't do that, then you are a bad person. Okay? It's all on you. You're bad. It's your fault that your family will succumb to the lizard people. Okay? And be tyrannized by them. It'll be all your fault if you continue to pay your taxes and don't spend that money on a bunker to hide from the government. Okay? The big old bad government. Okay, and the next reason for why you shouldn't be paying your taxes, number six, is because if you know, you're the average male, man, you know, you could also be a woman. But this, that's not the reason. So, but I'm talking to the men specifically for this one, okay? So if you're a woman, then just go in the other room. Set your phone down, set your laptop down, just go in the other room and hide in the closet for like 16 minutes like my friend Austin, except he's doing it forever for right now, you know, indefinitely. But, um, yeah, so then, basically, if you are a man and you have the, you know, average five, five inch eggplant size, you know, what's long and hard and has come in the middle, cucumber, uh, but if you have the average size for a man, you guys know what I'm talking about, then you basically are already way above any IRS agent. And I really do not see any reason for why you should be paying your tax dollars, your, your money, to anybody below you. Like, why would, why would you, as a Giga Chad male, you know, a, a top G, as most people would like to put it nowadays, give money to people who are not top Gs like you? Okay? They sit behind their desks, they punch numbers, they find out that you're not paying your taxes or, and tell you how much you should be paying them of your hard-earned uh, money. So basically, you know, if you got the average size, then that's way above any, any IRS agent, then you shouldn't be paying your taxes, because why would you pay people below you? You got to take what's yours in this world, okay? You got to be a big, strong man, hide from the government and all that, okay? The government's not your friend. I'm your friend. The guy behind the TV screen or the, your little phone screen made in China that's telling you not to pay your taxes. I'm your friend, not the government, okay? Okay, guys, next. Number seven. What's the IRS really gonna do? <laughs> okay? Is the IRS really gonna come out of their little, their, their little brick building and come after you and arrest you for not paying your taxes? No! No! The IRS isn't gonna do anything. If you don't pay your taxes, you'll be completely 100% fine, you know. Just come on, guys. That's, that's a little silly now. I think you guys have been on too much TikTok and it's melting your brains. Of course the IRS will not arrest you for not paying your taxes. And even if they do, you know, like I said, you're already not paying your taxes, so you're a big, strong, top Gmail. So they're not going to be able to come after you and get your tax money, okay? And if they do, it's just going to be like you're dangling in front of them. Oh, oh, you want my tax dollars? Come get it, you liberals. And they're not going to do anything. I mean, seriously, what are they going to do? Like, send out their 87,000 or whatever new IRS agents that they're commissioning and arming 
so that they can shoot you for not paying your taxes? I don't think so. They're a bunch of liberals that are just stuck up in the government and, and say, oh, I should be able to take your money, okay? I'm not going to come out there like a man and ask for your money, you know, to help all these projects. I'm just going to, I'm just going to sit here behind my desk and tell you that you have to pay money to me on the other side of the entire United States for something that you really don't support, okay? So that's why you shouldn't really be paying your taxes because, you know, IRS agents, what are they really going to do? Nothing. Yes, they will. Don't listen. Stay in school. The IRS will arrest you. That's just a joke. It's comedy. It's funny. Okay? Pay your taxes. The IRS will shoot you for not paying your taxes. You, know, okay? you can see it in all these training videos. Alright, reason number eight. And perhaps maybe one of the most important reasons on this list. Okay? Number eight. Girls will find you hot and edgy if you don't pay your taxes, okay? So you look at me, okay, top G, top guy, top, top man, top, top little samurai boy, okay? You look at me behind your, your screen and you say, he's got everything that I want, okay? Okay, he's absolutely rich. He's drowning in wealth, okay? He wears nice clothes, has nice hair. You know, he's built like a god. Come on! Okay, you look at me and you say he's got all the qualities I want. He's good looking, okay? He's jacked. He's wealthy. He's smart. He's intelligent. Those aren't the same two things. You can be smart and not intelligent, intelligent and not smart, okay? And he's also extremely tall, okay? It's, he's not 5'5". Five five. He is actually 6'3", okay? Um, it says so on my Instagram, so that's true. Okay, believe everything you see on the internet. And then you, like, it, it provides to my life, okay? I've got my friend and his girlfriend's little sister, you know? She's all over me. She sees what I have, everything that is desirable about a man, okay? I don't take, I don't take crap from anybody, and certainly not the IRS. I don't pay my taxes, okay? She sees me. I don't know if I should name drop at this point, but she sees me, okay? A man with everything. He's got the body, the looks, the hair, Okay, the height, you know, five, I'm 6'3", six, 6'3", three. Six, three, guys. So then you look at all these things, and then on top of that, I don't pay my taxes. She looks at me, a guy who does not pay his taxes, and it's like, wow. You know, she didn't realize this, but there is something extremely hot and extremely powerful about not paying your taxes to the IRS. Okay? It's absolutely amazing. You know? It, it, it gives you the edge over other men. So girls will find you hot and edgy for not paying the government your taxes. And that is why, like I said, probably one of the most important reasons for why you should not pay your taxes, especially if you are a single male. Because, you know, in order to get girls nowadays, you have to not pay your taxes. You have to be co cool and edgy. Okay? Hot, cool, and edgy. And you can't get that if you're paying your taxes. Okay? Absolutely nobody ever who has paid their taxes has a girlfriend or a wife. It's just not true, okay? It's never happened before. It's, I don't know what to tell you. All these people, you see, especially your parents, your mom and dad, if they're married, chances are, it's not chances are, it's absolute that they haven't paid their taxes at some point in time and that's why they had the attraction, the mutual attraction, and came together, okay? So like I said, girls will find you hot, sexy, attractive, and cool. If you evade your taxes, and that's why I evade my taxes every day, I do not pay a dime in taxes. I have never paid taxes once in my entire life, okay? And I, I probably never will, okay? Because, you know, what are they going to do? Take it from me? I don't think so, okay? Top G, I don't pay taxes. Neither should you. Okay, reason number nine. Okay, this is also a very compelling reason that I, I saw. I saw it out in the real world. And that made me think, gosh, I really shouldn't be paying taxes. So Disney's The Lion King, okay, Disney's hit movie The Lion King 
has a society where they have the king, they have the ruler, and none of the citizens in that society pay taxes. Okay? None of the sheep, or, or I don't know if they have sheep in the desert, out in, over there, but none of the gazelle, okay? None of the toucans or whatever is over that flying bird guy, none of, none of the other lions, none of the... There's a woman out there. None of the buffalo or the hyenas or whatever else is out in there. I don't know what animals are out there. But none of them pay taxes, okay? And their society in that movie, everything turns out just okay in the end. Everything's happy, hunky-dory, it's all happy. It turns out well in the end. So, you know, based off of that, that's basically evidence enough for why we shouldn't be paying our taxes. Because everything worked out in The Lion King. Like, he just holds the baby up, okay, and that, like, every 20 years whenever the lion dies, and then, you know, that's basically tax, that, that's basically payment enough for the entire kingdom. So, I don't think we really should be paying taxes if they don't do it in the Lion King, okay? If they don't, if they did, if they, why would they have, why would the Lion King, why would they not pay taxes in the Lion King? It doesn't make any sense, you know, if, because Disney is the ideal utopia of the world, and in there... They don't pay taxes. So why should we, if we want to be in an idealistic and good world, why should we be paying taxes? It just does not make sense when you try and connect the dots, okay? Okay, and the next reason, number 10. Probably, again, one of the most important. You, yes you, you are living in the matrix, okay? You're living in the matrix right now, so that means that paying your taxes is absolutely and 100% pointless, okay? You're in a fake virtual world, okay? You are basically paying your tax dollars, your money, your hard-earned money, to nothing, to the program, to the big AI in the sky that's trying to take your money, okay? You're basically just paying your money to Skynet, the, the robots that have taken over the world, and put and enslaved you and your entire family and the entire human population, okay? So only people like me who have really awoken our minds and unlocked our consciousness from these machines and who do not pay our taxes because we have woke, awoken from our deep synthesized slumber, only people like us who have realized these things can never be happy know what's going on, and if you want to really escape the matrix and not be a captive slave to the system, you should not pay your taxes. You would be spending your time so much better bending spoons and working, try bending spoons with all of your spare time in your bunker that you've used your money to hide from the government in. Okay? It would be better if you were to sit there and try and bend spoons to train your mind in order to be able to escape this matrix, this AI-induced hell that you are a slave into, that you are a captive property of. You should be spending every waking minute of every waking day if you are not awoken like I am and just living in the matrix for fun sometimes. You should be spending every waking moment of your life trying to bend spoons so that you have the mental fortitude and strength to break yourself free from the matrix and save yourself, save your soul, and save your family, and then hopefully save others so that they can escape from this hell known as the matrix. So guys, if you want to see more of this, please comment down in the comment section below, okay? If you want to see more of this stuff about how you can break free from the matrix, free your mind, you never trust the big guy in the sky, you know, comment down in the comment section. That will let me know that you guys need to see more of this, that you need to know how to free your minds, that you guys need to know the essential truths of life, okay? So comment down in the top comment section, subscribe, you know, tell your friends, and I will release another video about more reasons for why you should be evading your taxes, more reasons about why you should be questioning the big guy in the sky, the moon, which isn't real, okay? I'll release more videos about that so that you guys can stay informed and break your mind free from the matrix so that you can achieve happiness and completion and truly be awakened in this universe. All right, see you guys next time. 
Bust my gun. <laughs>